Hey, how's it everybody? Welcome to another video from Max Laser. And today we are going to be doing some laser cutting on acrylic. Now, the Thunderbolt, its strengths lie heavily, uh, more heavily, uh, on the engraving side because it is fitted with a 30 watt metal tube. Now, a 30 watt is not a strong laser tube, so I do know, well, I've got a hunch that it, it should be able to cut uh, five mil acrylic, but is it gonna be able to do six and is it gonna be able to do eight? So, also, when I'm talking about laser cutting, I'm talking about doing it in one single pass. Yes, I'm sure you can go a little bit thicker if you manipulate it and raise a bed and do multiple passes and stuff, but that's not how our job works. We want to do a job in a single pass. So let's put the Thunderbolt to its tests and let's see how thick we can laser cut acrylic. Okay, here I am um, cutting the 5 mil acrylic. And you can see I did do a test cut earlier on and um, everything was fine. It actually worked out quite well. Um, so those, that light that you're seeing from the honeycomb, that is refractions. That's what happens when your uh, settings are a little bit too strong. You actually get little chips on the edge of the acrylic. You can tone it down, so, if you have, so there you can see there's a little bit of uh, edginess, like little chips on the edge there, and that's because of the, that little bit of a light, light explosion. And you can get around that by just sorting out your settings. You can make it a little bit weaker, or you raise it off the honeycomb. So the Thunderbolt didn't come with another table, like a blade table. So you actually have to raise the acrylic off the honeycomb. And now you can see there isn't any uh, light that's being uh, any little uh, uh, light explosions that are starting to occur on the honeycomb. So it'll be nice and clean. Another nice thing is that I was cutting with the air assist on. So there you can see nice edges, nice and clean, polished look and feel. But also, I was cutting with the air assist on. And uh, usually I don't do that because I want a nice clean edge. But because the way that the Thunderbolt have designed the air assist, a little edge you can see that's a little bit to the side in a way. It doesn't create a smoky effect on the edge. So here I am trying to cut through 6mm acrylic. And uh, yeah, also. Look, I knew it was going to cut through 5mm acrylic, so I wasn't too sure, but here we're cutting at 6mm acrylic. And then I thought, you know, why don't I just go straight into it and cut the 8mm? You know, why waste any time? Let's just go straight into the 8mm, into the sign, and see what it can do. And uh, yeah, obviously I did a, a test cut before. I wasn't just going to go straight into it, but you know, here I'm doing the 8mm acrylic and it's cutting it beautifully. So I was super impressed about the, the cutting capabilities of the Thunderbolt. I honestly thought I was going to struggle at 6mm but I've cut it so clean. I did a test cut on 8mm and I thought nah, let's go straight into the side and this is it. Here's the house number that I'm cutting. 8mm, clean, edged, polished edges there which was so, so pleasing to see. Uh, so this is now 5mm acrylic cutting this with ease and uh, this house uh, number sign I'm just going to put the black acrylic onto the clear acrylic as you can see there and I, and I put it together with acrylic bonding glue so um, really nice beautiful um, you know this will go well in many people's uh, homes uh, in front of their homes uh, in corporates uh, you can use this type of of house numbers or corporate numbers um, you know this kind of signage it really really works out well you can see how nice and clean the cuts are on that 8 mil sure so nice so um, I'm very very happy with the way that it uh, came out very nice I like it so because I was quite excited about the 8 mil I thought well let's do the 10 mil <laughs> and I couldn't believe it it was actually cutting through the 10 mil Yes, it was a little bit slow and I really did have to push it to its limits. But how nice is that? Look at that nice, clean, polished look on a 10mm acrylic. So here you can see uh, this is the settings and the, the design file. Um, it was actually quite a nice uh, design for a house number. Um, I think it actually came out quite nicely. And um, yeah, so the blue is the black acrylic. 
and here you can see it at 7 millimeters per second at 60% power and as I mentioned before with air assist on and because the the air assist is moved away um, from the laser head at an angle it's able to be on and it doesn't transfer the smokiness onto the acrylic which is a great feature there I must be honest great feature there from from Thunderbolt so or from Thunder Laser with the Thunderbolt so I'm very happy with that because now you can actually cut acrylic with the air assist on and never worry about having the edges not being nice and uh, polished and uh, yeah so this is the sys, uh, sys, uh, settings for the 8 mil acrylic here it's at 3 millimeters per second air assist on and 60 percent power again and um, yeah obviously for the 6 mil acrylic the um, the power was at the speed was at 5 millimeters per second and power at 60. So overall, I'm actually quite happy with the end result. All right, there we go. So those are the results and I am super impressed with the Thunderbolt. Honestly, cutting 10 mil acrylic, a 30 watt metal tube, are you kidding me? Hey, that is fantastic. I actually didn't even give it a chance in actual fact. I didn't even buy 10 mil acrylic to test it because I just assumed it wasn't gonna cut it. I always thought I was going to really struggle just to cut through 8mm, but little did I know. So I was very happy with the, with the edges, polished look, very nice. Um, obviously contribution, co contributing factors, the hybrid servo motor um, fitted inside the machine and the beam spot diameter being small with the, with the metal tube. So a 30 watt cutting 10mm acrylic, I'm super stoked, super happy and I was very impressed. And the house sign actually came out really nice i'm actually very happy about that and uh, this is definitely something that you guys can do you know with the, with the thunderbolt you can actually make it much bigger than this as well um, in actual fact you can actually do individual letters and you can actually have a big uh, office sign uh, that is easily 10 meters uh, two meters wide um, with, with the thunderbolt so that's definitely something that you can do you can do certain type of signage with a Thunderbolt, no questions asked, especially cutting a 10 mil, uh, 10 mil, it's madness. On a side note, we do sell this acrylic, we don't have 10 mil, we've got 5 mil. We've got up to, up to 5 mil uh, clear cast acrylic, on, and also on white and on black, so that's just on a side note. So if you are looking, contact us. But I am super, super happy with the Thunderbolt, it really did very well in my eyes and uh, exceeded expectations. So. I will see you guys on the next video. Have a good day.